Hey guys, welcome to your love reading for Sagittarius. This is going to be for October 2023. You can apply this to your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs. Will they come back? So we're going to take a look at someone that you're in separation with, someone that you're not talking to, thinking of. We're going to see what caused the separation between you guys first, and then we will see if this person will come back. What else you guys need to know, look out for, work on. Apply this to your own unique situation. You may switch the rules if you want. Keep in mind that these are general messages. Take what resonates and leave the rest behind. If this message didn't resonate with you, you may take a look at your other placements. Keep in mind that these are collective messages for the collective Sagittarius people, not tapping into one specific person's energies in particular. If you're looking for a reading that's tailored specifically to your unique situations and your energies, I suggest you to uh, book a personal reading with me. The link for that is in the description box below. Like, share, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post, when I go live. Also, if you guys are interested in following me on TikTok and also on Instagram, the links for those are in the description box below. I do post readings on there too. I do also go live on my Instagram page where I do one question readings for $20. So make sure you are subscribed to my YouTube channel. The notification bell is turned on. I make the announcement on my YouTube community tab on when I do those, okay? And also you have to be following me on Instagram in order for you to join the live, all right? So tell me about um, Sagittarius in love. Um, the person that Sagittarius is separated from, thinking of, what caused the separation between Sagittarius and this person? What caused the separation between Sagittarius and this person? For October 2023, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for Sagittarius, for Sagittarius. All right, um... Two of Cups, okay. Soulmate connection here. Cancer energy with that Two of Cups. Six of Pentacles. It seems like there was equal give and take between you and this person here. Yeah, we have the Four of Wands, okay. Seems like you guys were solid here at some point. I'm not quite sure what happened. Let's see. We have the Hangman. Ace of Wands and the Ace of Pentacles. I don't, I'm not quite sure what happened here. It seems like you and this person was really solid here. Ace of Wands and the Ace of Pentacles here. Yeah, I'm not really quite sure what caused the separation here. I mean, it could, you know, it could be a situation maybe, um, you know, it was solid in the beginning and then this person started breadcrumbing you. Uh, this person didn't, didn't really quite sure what they wanted, what they were looking for here. You know, they have one foot in the door, one foot out the door. They pulled their energy back here. But whoever this is, we have three aces here. Um, yeah, something changed really quickly. Something changed really quickly as I feel, I feel like they were really into you. King of Cups and the... Page of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. And it seems like this person was really into you. I feel like this person was trying to romance you. You know, I feel like this person was trying to sweep you off your feet. This person was being very kind and very sweet. And then out of nowhere, I feel like it just completely changed, completely shifted. Maybe your person was like, oh my God, I think I found someone else that I'm interested in. So th this person maybe dipped out on you. The tower, Aries, Scorpio energy, the seven of wands here, um, the ten of wands and the ace of swords. It seems like this person went towards somebody new maybe. Yeah, it seems like this person dropped you like a hot potato here and moved towards somebody else. I mean, it could have been the situation that this person, uh, out of nowhere, they started pushing you away. They, they became really guarded, but um, I, I feel like, yeah, I feel like at one moment you guys were really solid, solid and then the, the, the next time everything just changed and you were just like, really surprised or just really confused. Um, uh, tell me about uh, Sagittarius. Will this person come back towards Sagittarius? Will this person come back towards Sagittarius for October 2023? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for Sagittarius. Will this person come back towards Sagittarius? Will this person come back towards Sagittarius for October 2023 for Sagittarius? We have Judgment and the King of Wands. Aries, little Sag. Yeah, I feel like they're going to try and reconcile here with you, but you don't want to talk to this person here, Sagittarius. I feel like it is Queen of Swords. 
Yeah, they, they, they're they going to want to come back. They, they're they going to want to try and reconcile here with you. I, I feel like you don't want any reconciliation with this person. Uh, you know, I just feel like you just don't want to deal with the back and forth. You don't want to deal with the drama here. I just feel like you're, you're, you, you I, I just feel like you're icing this person out. Yeah, I mean, that, that uh, Queen of Swords could be very, a very icy energy if you get on their bad side here. Um, yeah, we have the Star card, Aquarius energy. For you, I just feel like you're just focusing on your healing here. Whoever this is, I feel like this person is definitely waiting for you to come back. Maybe they sent out a message. Yeah, maybe they text you to see if you would respond. And they don't, I don't feel like you're going to respond. The Eight of Pentacles here and the Four of Pentacles. I feel like you have nothing to give to this individual here. Uh, you know, I, 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 and I feel like whoever this, I, I keep getting the sense or getting the feeling that this person is waiting for you to come back. Eight of Pentacles and the Four of Pentacles. They want to work on this connection. You know, uh, they want to put effort into this connection. It, I mean, for you, you could be focusing on your work here. I mean, they're really stressed out that, you know, you might be walking away from them for good. The Nine of Swords here and the Eight of Cups. You know, the, the decision that they made here, whatever this abrupt decision that they made here, I feel like this decision really haunts them because they know that they can't take it back. Yeah, they know that they can't take it back. All they could do is try and make things right here with you, but I feel like you're not even giving them the time of the day here, Sagittarius. Tell me about the uh, Queen of Swords here. We have the Empress. Yeah, you're totally leveling up here. You're just leveling up here. You know, one of the things I'm getting is I feel like whatever decision that you make here, I feel like this person's going to try and respect it, but I do feel like this person does really want you back. Queen of Pentacles, uh, no, the Empress Libra Taurus, uh, Knight of Pentacles, Capricorn Taurus Virgo, Eight of Pentacles. Why is the Eight of Pentacles here? And the uh, Devil, Capricorn Energy, Four of Pentacles. And the Five of Pentacles here. I, I feel like this person is like obsessing over you here. Yeah, I, I just feel like this person is very codependent, very needy. Uh, you know, I, I feel like this person also, uh, like, has, like, definitely some sort of behavioral issues here. Yeah. Yeah, I, I, I just don't, I just don't see you coming back together with this person. I feel like you, you're just really confused by this person at this time here. You rather close the door and disengage and move on. Yeah, and just focus your attention on other things here. And I feel like, um, you know, you're trusting your intuition in regards to the situation here. Yeah. I mean, you'd rather be alone and wait for your emperor than to deal with this again. And so I feel, yeah, so Sagittarius, I feel like you're done with this. Uh, but this decision that they made here, yeah, like I said, one moment you guys were really solid. And in that moment, everything changed here. So, you know, um, yeah. And I feel like this, this decision that they made or whatever they did here really haunts them. So Sagittarius, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Like this video, share this video, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and I will speak to you guys in the next one. Thanks, guys. Bye.